Introduction to Joel, author Joel, date written between 835 and 800 BC, time span. While the exact length of Joel's ministry is not known, his prophecies span the time until the future restoration of Jerusalem is complete. Title, the book is named after its author, the prophet Joel. Joel has been called the prophet of Pentecost. The name Joel means Yahweh is God. Background. Judah is setting for the book of Joel. It's devastated by a vast horde of locusts. This invasion of locusts destroys everything in fields of grain, the harvests and gardens, and the trees. Joel, symbolizes, Joel symbolically destri- describes the locusts as a marching human army. And views all this as divine judgment coming against the nation for her sins. Where written, probably Jerusalem, to whom? Primarily to the southern kingdom of Judah, but also to all Jews and Gentiles. Content. A terrible locust plague is followed by a severe famine throughout the land. Joel uses these happenings as the catalyst to send word of warning to Judah that unless the people repent quickly and completely, um, enemy armies will devour the land and did. The natural element, Joel, apply, Joel appeals to all the people and the priests of the land to fast and humble themselves as they seek God's forgiveness. If they will not, um, if they will, but respond, there will be renewed material and spiritual blessings for the nation but the day of the lord is coming at this time the dreaded locusts will seem as gnats in comparison as all nations receive their judgment finally joel gives an account of jerusalem's ultimate restoration and prosperity keyword locusts spirit the book of joel is highlighted by two major events one is the invasion of locusts, which devastates the lands of rebellious Judah. The other is God pouring out his spirit on all people, which will result in sons and daughters prophesying, old men dreaming dreams, and young men seeing visions. Joel chapter 2, verse 28. The initial fulfillment of this quote of this is quoted by Peter in Acts as having taken place at Pentecost. Themes. Without repentance, judgment will be harsh, thorough, and certain. Our trust should not be in our possessions, which can be taken from us, but in the Lord our God. God at times use, uh, may use nature, sorrow, and common occurrences to draw us closer to him. God's covenant with his people will endure forever. Outline number one, invasion of locusts is found in Joel chapter 1 verse 1 through Joel chapter 2 verse 11. Number 2. God's mercy on the repentant is found in Joel chapter 2 verses 12 to 27. And number 3. Final judgment and triumph of God is found in Joel chapter 2 verse 28 through Joel chapter 3 verse 31. May the Lord add a blessing to the introduction of the book of Joel.